I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth? You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more from me. He'll be fine. I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. Let me help you. He's <laughs> having a bad day. That makes two of us. I guess it's a good thing fables are hard to kill. Suppose it is. These lips are sealed. Sorry. Hey, you like my ribbon? If you don't answer my questions, I can't help you. I'm answering them the best that I can. I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Shit. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. Sure? Uh, he's had enough. For tonight, at least. Wouldn't be surprised if he has an axe to grind, though. That wasn't intentional. Sorry. How much was it he owed you? A hundred. I'm guessing bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. Let's see, I've got, uh... It's 20, 40, 7, 8, 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Just take the money. You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office, then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I... You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. Wow. Tell me what you really think. Hey. I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. I'll see you around, Wolf.
apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. Come on out. All right, all right. Beauty. Hello, Big B. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd, but there's an explanation, I swear. You're out pretty late. Is there some sort of curfew I don't know about? What's with a third degree? Damn it, I'm late. Please, Bigby. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is, and it would just make my life a lot easier. Look. Whatever it is, it's between you and Beast. I'm staying out of it. I don't have time to go into it right now. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. It's not what you might be thinking. Bigby, hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Nope, haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it, something's going on. Thank you. 
Hey, Colin, get up. Hey. Oh, hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? I'm tired, Colin. It's been a long day. Got a smoke? Thanks. A couple thousand more of these, we'll be even on that house you owe me. This has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Don't be a pain in the ass. I'll tell you what I told Toad. And what's that? I can't give you a free pass. Lectured by the big bad wolf. He must have loved that. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's...